the Brick Zone. You have failed this city. My name is Will, and here are just a bunch of olive green arrows that I got off of Brick Forge. In total, I got 15, and they came in sets of three. Each set included an explosive arrow, a two-headed broadhead arrow, and a four-bladed razorhead arrow. Since I had all of these green arrows lying around, I figured why not give them to Green Arrow himself. So, here's Green Arrow with all of those arrows I just showed you guys. He's holding an explosive arrow, and besides the five explosive arrows, so the one he's holding along with the four off-screen, I was able to fit the rest of the arrows inside his little quiver there. Well, I guess it's not so little. It's now, I guess it's not really a quiver. It's more like a basket, really. But you can see all the arrows there. Uh, you know, they don't fit exactly, but I think it, it has a cool look, at least if you're looking at them from the front. And, uh, you know, if you want to show off more of the actual detail of the arrow, like the arrowheads, you can do that in reverse. It's just that you won't be able to fit as many just because you'd have these uh, minifig-sized pegs there. But that would definitely that would definitely look cooler. And just something else to show off, since you know Green Arrow there is just like a Lego minifig. Here is another figure. I think it might be Ezio or maybe just some generic assassin. I'm pretty sure it's Ezio from Assassin's Creed. If we zoom out, or I guess we could just there he is. And that bow is not from an order I've made recently. It's actually from a past order. Maybe if I had an arsenal, that would have that would have gone well with him. But I, I don't have an arsenal. But yeah, that compact bow is also from uh, from Brick Forge, and it was actually a free item I got in addition to whatever I ordered at the time. So you know, it works out that these arrows are compatible with it because there's actually a slit in the bow itself there where you can actually put the arrow so it's it's as if he's actually about to fire and I just think that's awesome <laughs> I mean I'm sure if you got now these arrows are just flying all over the place now if you I'm sure if you got like a really small uh, not small a really thin really tiny drawstring you could probably tie it onto that bow and and just make it look really realistic and that's just really cool but yeah, as you can see here, I'm just putting the arrows back in with the arrowhead facing up, just so you can kind of see that. I guess when you're when he's pulling them out of his quiver, it would make sense to to not have the arrowhead the arrowheads facing up anyway. But um, here's just what that looks like. It's not all of them, missing a couple, but I think if I take it out, it looks a little better. Now everything is blurry. Okay, focus. All right, so that pretty much does it for the arrows. Really, not much else I can say. I mean, they're just they're arrows. Uh, the shafts, uh, the shafts of the arrows themselves are pretty thin. They are they're thinner than um, you know a, a, a Harry Potter wand or like those bar size for the the minifig hands. But you know it's cool. If you have one of these compact bows, uh, I'm, I'm just kind of let down that I didn't get a, an olive bow for a Green Arrow here. It's kind of stuck with the, the Lego one that just comes in this plain green color. Would have been nice to get that in olive so it would match the arrows. But uh, maybe for Season 2 he'll get an upgrade. He'll get one of those compact bows uh, the Assassin has there. I, I just think that that's a really good look on both of them, really. But yeah... That's that's it for this video. What do you guys think of these arrows? These 15 arrows that I got. Uh, it was it was like a deal, so you know, don't think that I spent like a bunch of cash on just like just arrows. But uh, they should be useful for stop motions and other things, I think. And just for green arrow to have, I think they're nice. And I think that's the main reason I got them. Just just as a little extra thing. Uh, it was very cheap, so I, I figured might as well add it to all that uh, powered assault. Uh, am not th all that powered assault armor that I I'd, I'd gotten in that order, but yeah, 
What do you guys think of these arrows? Uh, I pers I like that there are like multiple kinds, like the explosives and the, the four tipped and the the double tipped bladed arrows. Um, yeah, really not much else to say about them. Um, okay, so other than that, uh, leave a comment with your thoughts, like or dislike the video, depending on if you liked it or disliked it, and check out some more videos here on the Brick Zone if you want to see more reviews and stop motions.